Hey guys, welcome back to Thornapple Creek Farms. So, got ourselves a new little calf there. Of course, you know, I'm only at work like 10 days a month, 10 24 hour shifts. How do these calves keep dropping when I'm at work? Katie ended up uh, taking care of this one as well, and uh, we'll get you some video of that one. But another heifer calf, she seems to be doing okay. She looks a little bit cold right now, so we're gonna get some new bedding in here and get her taken care of. Mama did really well. Um, initially, she kind of rejected her just a little bit, but uh, they warmed up to each other here pretty quickly. But that's what we got going. New calf on the ground, good and healthy. Always good day. Oh, here it comes. What we got coming out here is what's called the water bag. That's usually always the first presentation. And again, this is the view that I had at work. We actually put this on the big screen on the TV at work. I had the entire station watching this cow give birth. <laughs> here you go. This is just minutes after her giving birth. Katie had to give just a little bit of a pull on that calf in order to get it out all the way, but mom did most of the work, and here she is kind of taking a well-deserved little rest. Um... Katie starts trying to coax this cow to stand up, but she wouldn't stand up. And then uh, <clears throat> Katie kind of right on her own here. She's, like I say, she's getting pretty good at this, I guess. She, uh, watching a lot of YouTube videos and whatnot, she actually takes the calf and drags it up to mom's face. Mom starts licking it like that, and uh, wasn't but just a few minutes after she started licking it, uh, she was able to get stood up. Just be real slow. You can go better. Hmm. Good job. <laughs> hey, Em, Em, can you come over here? Why? Just because I don't want you behind the cow.
All right. I know you're the star of the show yesterday, but can you move for me just a little bit? Thank you. I know. I know. Okay. Let's see if Mama Cow will come over here and look at us. There you go. Come here. All right. So the only thing that I do with baby calves is I take a little syringe of iodine. And you try to do this as early as you can. Obviously, I wasn't here last night. but Just spray some iodine on there umbilical cord on their navel so it dries it up keeps them from getting any infections up in there and then we're just going to get that little baby calf she looks kind of cold so we're going to get her some fresh drop Okay, can you tell everybody thanks for watching? No, are you a little shy? Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Thanks for watching. As always, if you like this kind of content, like and subscribe. We'll try to bring you more of it. I'd say that spot should work. <laughs>